Kennedy Carter is back in the WNBA. For now, at least. Uh, Kennedy Carter has signed a training camp contract with the Chicago Sky. And um, as a play, as a person who who knows how good Kennedy Carter was, um, or slash is, um, she's still balling right now. Um, I am very much excited as a as a Chicago fan, as, as a Chicago Sky fan, I am very much excited for Kennedy Carter to be joining the Chicago Sky. Um, we we will see um if she makes the team. Again, this is a um this is a um a training camp contract. So so you know, there we'll see. You know, she'll have to earn her keep um in terms of making the team, but you know, it's it's promising. It is it is very, very much promising. Um for those who don't know Kennedy Carter, Kennedy Carter is the fourth uh, was the fourth overall pick in the 2020 draft, uh, WNBA draft. Um, and, and she's ready to, to come back to the WNBA. She's only 25 years old. Um, and she's, she's, uh, been out of the league for a little bit. Um, as, as a, as a player in the WNBA, um, she was balling as a rookie. She had 17, she's, she's averaged 17.4 points a game as a rookie. Um, and, and she was second in our rookie of the year voting that year. Um, when, when she, uh, when she, um, uh, came back as a, as a second year player in the WNBA, um, again, she was with Atlanta. Uh, she averaged, uh, 14.2 points that season. Uh, she didn't play that full season. Uh, she was limited, uh, due to a injury. And also she was, um, suspended for conduct deemed detrimental to the team. Um, she, was then traded to the LA Sparks, uh, where she played for them. Um, and that season for the LA Sparks, she averaged eight, uh, 8.9 points a game. Um, she did have an injury, uh, for, 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 for that, uh, that time with LA Sparks as well. Um, and she did, she was benched for, for, um, a couple of games as well. So, so she's kind of had a, a rough, time in the WNBA, uh, due to injury and due to, um, you know, um, some sort of issues, uh, conduct detriment to the team for, for the, uh, Atlanta dream and then her being benched for about four games, uh, with the LA Sparks. Um, she played overseas, um, for the last several years, um, because she, she didn't make a WNBA team last season. Um, so she, she played overseas. Uh, she played in the KBSL, uh, for Bursa, um, which is a, uh, Turkish team. Um, and she averaged 24 points a game, um, in, in that, in that league. Uh, she, right now she's playing over in China and she's balling in China right now. She's averaging 28.9 points a game in China. Um, and also she's doing her thing on rebounding front as well. She's averaging, um, 8.9 rebounds a game. Uh, so yeah. Yeah. Um, so Teresa Weatherspoon has signed Kennedy Carter, um, we will see, um, how she does. I, I hope that she, she does make the team. Kennedy Carter is a very, very talented player. Um, very, very much talented. Um, you know, the Chicago sky has gone through a lot in a couple of days. Uh, we, we lost, um, two of our starters, um, um, previously, uh, in Courtney Williams and Alana Smith, who decided to sign, they were free agents. They, they decided to sign with the Minnesota Lynx. Um, uh, Kalia Copper um, requested a trade um, after we did not get um, Neka Ogumike or um, Skylar Diggins Smith to choose Chicago. They both chose Seattle. So Kalia Copper wanted a trade. She wanted out. So she's gone. Um, we re signed uh, Diamond to Shields, which is a player who won us, who helped win us the championship, um, you know, um, before for the Chicago Sky. So she's making her Sky return. Um, and we got some draft picks. Um, the Chicago sky look is going to look like a very different team next year. Um, and yeah, so, so, uh, we, yeah, we're, we're, we're trying to, we're trying to make something happen. Um, I'm not sure exactly what, what the, what the sky will look like in the future, but, uh, but Kennedy Carter is a very talented player. So we'll see, we'll see if she's able to make, make the roster. We also, um, signed Lindsay Allen, um, from the free agency market as well. She is a point guard, 
uh, for the team. So um, it's likely that Dana Evans will be the starting point guard and uh, Lindsey Allen will be coming off the bench. Uh, we also signed uh, Kaiser uh, Gondrzic, uh for a, um, a training camp contract as well. Um, so we will see if she will be able to make the roster also. Um, in the uh, in the trade for for um, in the trade for uh, Kalia Copper, we traded her to the um, the Phoenix Mercury, and we got um, we got Michaela Onyewede, and we got um, Brianna Turner from the Phoenix Mercury. We also got the number three pick in this year's draft, and we have some picks in consequential drafts. Um, so that is the news, guys. That is your Chicago Sky update. I know a lot of y'all are not Chicago Sky fans, but as a Chicago fan, um, I have to let you all know what's going on with my team. Um, let's see what y'all got to say about um, about uh, um, about um, the Chicago Sky. Uh, first, uh, Bear Down says, uh, Quita, thank you for having a peaceful women's basketball space where folks can talk about nothing but ball. Well, thanks. I, appreciate that. I mean, that's what I, that's what I try to do. That's what I really, really try to do. Um, I, I appreciate y'all. Um, Adrian says teaspoon will be good for her. I agree. I agree. Uh, Bear Down says we better get Rakia. That's who I want us to get as the number three pick. Um, yeah, I, I want us to get Rakia Jackson. Um. Uh, Michael says, who, who do you hope the sky draft at number three, depending on who comes out? Um, I think Rakia Jackson, uh, would be a good player. Um, Rakia Jackson, her game to me, remind she, her game reminds me of Kalia Copper in, 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 in quite a few ways. Um, so I would, I would, um, yeah, I would, I would like, I would like to, uh, to, for them to draft her. But if, if a player like, um, if a player like Cameron Brink were to drop to, to three, then yes, we get we get we get Cameron Brink. I don't think Cameron Brink drops to three. Um, um now, as of right now, I don't think Cameron Brink drops to three. But yeah, if she drops to three, yes, we we want to get her. Um yeah, this rebound this rebuild is gonna be really rough. It is, it is, but you know, it is what it is. <laughs> 